Hi friends, Suzanne here. Welcome to another card kit of the month video. In order for me to send you this card kit right to your Canadian mailbox, all you have to do is enter this host code when you're shopping with me. It's that easy. There's more information about this card kit and my loyalty rewards at my blog, sunstampin.com. Before we get started, I wanted to mention that each active member of my team also receives card kits of the month for just being on the team. So if you're a customer of mine and think you may miss out on this customer perk by signing up for the starter kit, don't worry. Actually, team members get treated like VIPs by me and get quite a few additional perks. If you've been thinking about joining up for the best deal Stampin' Up! can offer, like con a continuing 20% discount, purchasing products before they're released to the public, and access to a whole lot of free inspiration, please consider joining my team. I will leave a link in the description box below that leads to a page where I can answer all of your questions and I want to share with you that it is truly an amazing gift to be a Stampin' Up! demonstrator. I am blessed with the most amazing team of kind-hearted, talented Canadian demonstrators. I would love for you to become one of us and experience the joy that we all share for this company and the craft. This card kit has many different colorways. I am using some of the designer series paper from Celebration called Dandy Designs and it's super, super cute. The card design here was a creation of Angie Judas uh, st from uh, Stampin' Up! in the United States and I adapted this card design um, and I thought it would be great for uh, a card kit because here you have your card base and you're going to put it in your trimmer and cut it so that you the top left hand uh, side corner there and the bottom right hand side quarter is in your paper trimmer there and you are going to slice it diagonally in half. It doesn't work the other way <laughs> it only works this way um, and it's a, a it was a learning experience as I cut this paper too because there's a right way and a wrong way to do that. <laughs> anyway it has to be the way it is. So uh, there is a diagonally cut piece of paper in your kit and again this is from Dandy Designs. You can't get this paper anymore so this card kit is um, a, a true treasure for those of you who didn't get the dandy designs you're going to get um, I tried to pick the cutest uh, papers and uh, this is one of them the balmy blue version so um, and you can see what I'm doing here so there's a designer series paper on the inside of the card as well as on the outside and then there's this little mm, mini flip <laughs> um, and I'm putting a basic white card on the inside of the card of this little mini fold here. I don't know what this card, this fun fold is called. Um, I'm not really one to label anything, so uh, I'm happy to just have a fun fold to um, create with. How's that? <laughs> so now we're gonna put adhesive on the back. And again, no one's got the exact same, like two of the blues or two of the yellows. Everyone's got a mix up. So we're going to adhere this directly in the center of my inside card panel. And it, I mean, you'll be able to figure it out. It just goes in the middle. There's no, there's no rhyme nor reason to it really, because as long as you can close that uh, diagonal piece in it, it's perfect. And then we're going to stamp on the other basic white, but whilst I'm, uh, you know, doing one, I might as well to do two. And again, so we're just putting that basic white 
uh, card bit inside. We're going to use um, uh, the other basic white for stamping. And so I'm just going to put together the Mango Melody card together. So this is the inside panel. Again, it's similar to the blue. Uh, there was a whole bunch of different patterns that I chose. Um, I chose to demonstrate with these two. And again, the I, I mainly concentrate my adhesives on the corners um, and then sort of fold them over. And then I try um, with this Seal Plus adhesive, um, I know I have a love-hate relationship with it because sometimes it doesn't come out of the can, the holder, but I tell you, it's really strong. Like you don't have to ever use too much on that. Like that uh, adhesive is really strong. All right, and then um, again, I'm just going to put uh, this inside card piece to the inside, and then we're gonna get to stamping here. Now, uh, I, Angie Judah used those um, adorable owls and she cut it out and fussy cut and colored them and all of that while well, I'm doing a, something a little more simple. So this is petal pink and this is a splatter that has come from a new stamp set called Hello Irresistible. So uh, again, I'm using uh, balmy blue for this one and I use petal pink for the other and I might as well talk about the um, online exclusives that is where the uh, irresistible blooms comes from it comes with a die set as well the dies are beautiful I highly recommend getting them the papers are amazing and they're on sale right now there is no date that you can't order from but some of the products may go unsellable like uh, uh, back ordered some are going to be replaced I'm not sure what the um, what the plan is for these online exclusives but I'm showing you some examples from the Stampin' Up! design team because I think they're beautiful and I wanted you to know about my brand new online class that I'm launching with these products called the Hello Irresistible Mega Online Class. I have eight card examples um, and of course you can order um, option one which gives you the bundle and then um, some papers and the embellishments and then a consumables plus my videos and all of that and free gifts and yada 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 I'm gonna put the description or I'm gonna put the information in the description bar below so hopefully you'll think of me as your demonstrator it's just me uh, demonstrating eight projects to you and I think you're going to love them all so look at that beautiful font so nice so pretty um and I you know I can't I I could have done more examples uh with this stamp set that was like the creativity was just flowing with it so you know how sometimes you get those products this is one of them Anyway, that's soft sea foam there for the leaves that come in that particular stamp set. Of course, if you don't have that stamp set yet, please go ahead and use your own for this card kit. I'm sure that you are creative enough to figure it all out and have it look beautiful. So you don't have to buy the entire store to make a beautiful card. And especially if you get this card kit. All right, so I'm just going to adhere these panels to the front of the uh, cards. Uh, this one goes because it's balmy blue. It goes with the balmy blue one and the other one was Calypso Coral and that's going to go into the Mango Melody. I really like those um, flowers in the paper. I don't know why it's like a throwback to the 70s. I dig it. <laughs> You can see all the supplies I used today listed below in the video see more section or in the supplies section on my blog and those fast links are going to take you to my Canadian online store. I would love the chance to meet you and earn your business. So thank you so much for watching and bye for now.